What is happening, y'all? Look at this place. It's so pretty. So colorful. It's so different from the volcano. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to... I think we're going to ride this. Try to ride that. And then if that don't work, sneak around, murder a thing here, and head on in. So let's see. Let's see. Because I don't want to kill dude. We're going to go to the... I mean, the fact that... Okay, alright guy, you wanna play like that? Let's play like that. You weren't the first gargoyle I have fought, by the way, so, you know. So far you're the most annoying, I'll give you that. Other friend, the Black Gargoyle. His weapon sends its regards. Pick that up. It's kind of neat. Giant Gargoyle War Cry. Eh. Back on track. I'm gonna run on up this big long bridge. We're back on track. Gonna go to where the earth tree lives. Back on track. Gonna take out this dungeon real fast. Hello. Once prophesized, one did become Elden Lord. Creep trees the begets the pillars of light, tarnish, chase into the foot of a tree. Okay, weirdo. Uh, so do I approach this way? But what about like this? I mean, the gates might not even open. Let's just head up and see what happens, I guess. Because this has like, this has major, uh, like, Lorian, Lorian vibes, you know, when it's like you're... Alright, this, this door don't open. Why I expected it would open, but I kind of had a feeling. I was like, you know, why would I even? Why would I be able to just go straight to the main big door? That obviously wasn't gonna work. But yeah, we got a lost ash of war. I don't, you know, I have no reason to use those. But I mean, they have their their purpose. To just you know, I have been. Uh, Unique stuff, a bunch. Golden Perry. That sounds good. Perform an Earth Tree incantation and swing the shield to deflect enemy attacks and break their stance. Effective even at a slight distance. What? So wait, is it just like, even if somebody whiffs their attack, like somebody's shitty, and they just like piss poor range it, 
you still break their stance and, and parry them? Because if so, that sounds freaking hilarious. Like, oh, you whiffed. Doesn't matter. Still, <laughs> still fucking got it. Like, let's put that on. Imagine how, how awesome that would be in PvP. Make it holy. The standard's fine. But like, I use a shield for blocking it all. Turtle. Cut up this, we're gonna swing a left, circle that thing to see what's there, murder the earth tree, get into this area. And if I'm lucky, somewhere along this journey, between either here or the next zone, I'm gonna find that person who has the other half of the secret medallion. See, the thing is, I don't even know what that tree is. That tree he was talking about, I have not heard of that at all. So that's, that's another thing that's like really throwing me off about this, this whole like backtrack. Because I knew there was something there, but I thought it was up top. And it, it's the other thing now I'm concerned, because I wonder, like when I went here, I kept like, you know, I did like a serpentine type thing. And I went back and we went here and we did stuff. And I remember running through this and not seeing anything. But I just remember seeing cliffs and cliffs and... Well, I mean, that area was getting, like, mad fucking shader bugs, too. So that definitely didn't make things easier. But a whole little underground village there? This is joint at the Grand Lift of Dectus, connecting the Altus Plateau. Grand lift of rolled, granting access to a hidden path. Secret medallion will guide the bearer to the land of Michaela Alec Tree. It has to be in the region we haven't been. Like there's nothing anywhere that we've seen that well so this is a this is a lift mechanism. Grand lift of Dectus. Have we seen anything else like that? I think so. I think, hang on, let me look again. Is that design match here? Similar to it, this has like two rails leading up. No, that's more of a churchy design. Ah, grand lift of Halleck Tree. I mean, well, maybe it is the region we haven't been to yet, because that would make sense if it's like, you know, some legendary person. A merchant here? Yeah, yeah, we do. What's up, buddy? What you got? Uh, runarks are always good. Perfume bottles are mostly garbage. Uh... Yeah, we're good. I'll take the rune arcs and be on my way. Earth tree time. It's time for some earth tree guardian murder. Earth tree guardian. Get another flask with my four gold seats after I kill the guardian. A tree guardian murder. Ah, look, what are these little things? Oh, they're like necromatic snails. That's cool. Uh, how do we? Give me a skill that allows Torrent to jump from any height without taking fall damage. That's what I want.
Actually, screw that. Give me my Breath of the Wild glider. I don't care that it's Dark Souls. Let me hold my cape and glide down. <laughs> uh, I don't even see one. What the fuck are you guys? I just like belly bump 1200 damage into that dude because when we tried it earlier we tried it on fire slugs and I remember saying like well they're fire slugs so twiggy cracked tear and crimson crystal tear okay uh, of a half-ass guardian but you know we can't all be winners I know the big erd trees here there's probably lots of limited number of guardians and you know they're overworked and underpaid and that's just the world right now you know big labor movement makes sense who wants to fucking work 40 hours a week just to retire when you're fucking 60 and then basically die it sounds miserable like real talk transitioning to like i still cause I, even though i'm full-time youtube now i still keep the the government job part-time uh, cause, you know, health benefits are a thing in our amazing American healthcare system. Uh, damn archers. Oh, shit. Okay, we're gonna stay sharp. Um, but part of going down to part-time, instead of doing, like, you know, four hours a day, five days a week, I just do five-hour days, four days a week. And, dude, a four-day work week is fucking bomb it is so damn good because i mean you just you you always have a three-day weekend and so you have so much more time to do shit you have a weekday that's off and this is like super tree bro uh you know but always always having a day that's off to like do stuff that's all because so there's all that, there's so much shit that gets closed so it's like oh you have to go to that sorry we're we're only open on uh we're only open on weekdays. It's like, well, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? It's a day before day work week. Go on Fridays. Is hurting him, just not as much as. Ow, bro, calm down. this out now. I have a feeling some bullshit like that was coming. He's gonna die still. He was about to die right there. Broke bitch, you're so dead. You're so you're so <laughs> fucked this time. Ah, uh, you survived by the grace of me spamming belly bumps.
Okay, now it's not fucking cute anymore. The first time, whatever. I was belly bumping. That time, no, 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 no. No, 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 we're not playing that game. Let me explain how this is about to go down. First up, I'm gonna ride behind your ass because you're slow. Then, I'm gonna summon Oleg on top of you. Then, I'm gonna run. We're gonna do that, because she's a bitch. I'm gonna heal it. Then... Come on. your lightning and you got staggered. Bro, what the fuck? Why? Why am I glass cannoning this? Like, you are not hard. This is ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. Like, I'd be okay with it if it was, you know, like, a boss boss, but this is- you're- you're a fucking... You're a glorified tree sentinel, bro. I don't even have words right now. Like, this is... Uh... <laughs> uh... I mean, you know what? I think my lightning absorption is my lowest absorption. Let me see. Yeah, my lightning absorption is like sub 10%. So that's why lightning just kills me instantly.
Dragon Great Claw and Shield. It's a colossal weapon that strength dex smash physical. Let's take the Dragon Great Axe. Endure anchored stance for attacks, boosting poise. And then a big shield with shield bash. With lightning. So you're doing a lightning shield bash. That all sounds cool. A little more, a little more effort than I thought he would. Uh, yes, I will come on into the city now. I'm looking for uh, the lord of this region. Something about how I need to beat his ass and take his rune so I can go to another region. And then that region is needed because that is where I get to kill somebody so that the serpent guy decides that we're going to be friends and eat the uh, Elden tree together. We're going to eat the tree. I half expected something like that to happen, like when the snake stopped and I saw him and he's like, oh, hmm. I thought he was going to like pull out the shard of the Elden Ring and be like, you want this? Take the shard, child of my house. Become a god to slay others. Something, but then his whole like, join me, blah, blah. I, I think I was, uh, I'm pretty sure his idea of the join him was like, become part of the amalgamation of various body parts that are on his sword. And, you know, uh, I gotta be honest, it's not really my style. I mean, I get it, you know, everyone has, has their own thing. And I'm not one to knock somebody else for how they like to float their boat. Yeah, that sucks. The range on it's just not that good. Where are we going? Behold tree. Yes, behold tree. Yeah, I definitely need a new talisman. I mean, I'm like the dragon stuff I've been vibing with a lot. There's also that one talisman we got that was the Erd Tree one, probably just boosts everything. Oh, hey there, white fool. My utmost thanks for bringing me to the base of the Erd Tree. Here, I can govern my own movement, and thus, the accord is fulfilled. I shall depart to ascertain the purpose I was given. Farewell. I shall leave Torrent, and the power to turn runes into strength. Here, with you. I wish you luck in realizing your ambition. You have fought long and hard. I have no doubt you will become Elden Lord. May you take the throne. You want to be my wife? I guess that's a no. Uh, dragon decay, dragon ice. Wrath is God. This is good. That is good. Ah, oh, I wish the God Slayer stuff was good. Like this especially, that's the most disappointing. God, you put it on and it just, boop, vanishes like near instantly. And I could just work that on. That's gonna be on for, for PVP purposes. Yeah, why not? Let's do that. I mean, it's it's rare that I would need it, but I'm kind of curious to see if I can force madness onto an invader. And then just have him be like, bang, 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 bang. Leyendel, the royal capital, be wary of tears, visions of Elden Ring, good luck. Okay. That's cute, guys. Little magical bubbles. Uh, 
someone needs to explain to this guy that you need to play more than one note on the sax. I was half expecting to hear like a little mini saxophone solo. I was like, oh yeah. What up, my guy? What the fuck? What the fuck are you? I don't think this... It looks like they're... I don't know. I feel like they wouldn't be weak to holy. They look very holy-ish. Oh, you need no legs. Okay. 256. 33. I'm fine with that. I put on potency of incantations. Yeah, the charging is better for me. See where it goes. And then we'll go back up. Perfumers. This seems like it's a continuation. So let me go back and clear the top out first. I think there's just like another bubble boy to kill. See that pathway. So far, Royal Capital's feeling pretty breezy compared to uh, Stormvale and Royal Academy. And I'd like to think it's because I opted to complete literally everything I could in this zone beforehand. Because I'm I, I took a very different approach here than I did with the other major zones and now now it is paying off in spades. Like I am just going around murder hoboing this place. Thing there, you're dead. Thing there, you're dead. You're dead. You're dead. This guy's dead. This guy's dead. You're dead. I'm gonna kill you. Oh, 
My turn. I see what you got. guys are literally the only threat everything else down here i was like killing you killing you killing you killing you and then in comes fucking avalon explosive bolt man damn it ah all right let's um let's wrap we we didn't really get to push deep into this place but i think we're we're going to i mean it's going to take a minute to get through it anyway we got, actually, we got pretty far in. Looking at it, we got probably a quarter of it done. So, more coming your way soon with the Royal Capital. We'll catch you all then.